The Hazel Wright organ is truly one of the great organs of the world, and I've often thought that it's quintessentially American in its conception because you think of America as the melting pot, and this instrument is an amalgamation of uh, two different organs uh, from two different countries. Well, to see an instrument uh, be resurrected, to come back to life, so to speak, uh, is uh, truly one of the greatest joys for an organist, especially an instrument like this. Um, when I first encountered it, uh, pistons weren't working, buttons weren't functioning. It was terribly out of tune. There was a lot of damage to the pipework. And, uh, you know, it, something so complicated, you wonder what can be done with it. Well, my goodness, uh, the Rufati family just worked magic with it. And this instrument now is truly at its high point. It's profoundly inspiring to witness the church here in Orange County be so committed to this monument of an organ and of music, and certainly Bishop Kevin Van is to be thanked, a uh, music lover himself, and it is an extraordinary testament to the dedication of the ministry here, and I couldn't be more proud of David Ball, the director of music and organist at the Cathedral, a former student of mine, for carrying uh, the music ministry here to greater heights. Um, I'm sure Fred Swan would be very proud to see that the music making is in good hands here. And uh, I look very much forward to the future and great things to come.